Gentlemen, welcome back to the shop. Make cool shit and put it on tinternets. This here is cool shit. We don't have nearly enough chuckles to share of late in the shop, especially in this day of safetyism and nanny statism and uh, abdicating all your personal accountability. Occasionally, you come across a piece of gear what's so old it's grown its own soul and it would gladly rip your arm clean orf if given the chance. Graham from the Diode Press uh, made these lino cuts for us and did some printing. I'll be giving these away. Take heed. Apparatus predates safety. In the style of a brass tag. I'm going to make some stickers for these. They'll be available uh, for your consideration over on the Etsy as well. The tap and die charts are going to be uh, magnets. A fellow has been asking me for years for a magnetic tap and die chart. Some places you're working, you don't like you putting tap and die charts, especially cheeky ones like this, on the boss's machines. Got the Swedish, our patron saint, the Swedish nut fucker, with a, our motto if it ain't broke, try harder. They're also better than the usual tap and die charts because. You got the decimal equivalent right here on the side. You don't need to flap the thing over. You see, you actually need two of these kind stuck with magnets because uh, you got to pull the magnet off and flip it over to find out what the decimal is. It's stupid. It's stupid. So in this case, you get a twofer. You don't got to flip it over and it comes with its own magnet. Huh? Huh? You get a gratuitous shot of my former mistress, the old Bridgeport. We'll get her uh, chooching again, but you can trust to your luck or trust to your legal tender. If you want some of these, I will uh, gladly give you some away. Or if you prefer to make sure you get some, go over on into the Etsy there and you can purchase these. They're expensive as frig because you're worth it. <laughs>